Good morning, I am Husky Lai and welcome to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. Uh, this is our Angel Oracle cards for um, Monday the 13th of April 2015 and we are starting off with if I put that a bit more forward can you see it a bit more clearly? Yes we can. Uh, we're starting off with Archangel Raguel uh, our peace and harmony. Thank you, Archangel Raguel, for surrounding my life in a harmonious light. A wave of harmony is being washed over your life right now. Please trust that the angels are here to help you resolve any conflicts that have been disturbing your inner peace at this time. Wow, <laughs> that's a nice, powerful card to start off with on a Monday. Um, Take time to surrender to God and the angels and any concerns that you have about any conflicts or arguments and allow them to lovingly guide you to peace. And our power husky genie completely agrees with Archangel Raguel that this is happening. Um, yeah, any conflicts, any arguments, anything that you are not at peace with, Hand it over to Archangel Raguel, hand it over to your higher consciousness, your Archangels, everybody up there, um, your guides. Hand those fears over. The best thing I can do or say to help you, uh, something that I always used to do, and I still do because I still get fears and doubts all the time, obviously, um, is I say, I'm sorry, I love you, please forgive me. And then I will say, Please, angels, transmute my fears and my doubts concerning this situation or this person or whatever's going on in my life. And, and I just transmute it up to them for them to transmute it, to get rid of it, to trust that they will look after those fears and doubts and clear them, help you to clear them by giving you the answers that you need to help you get over the situation. The angels are asking you to stand down from any conflict that is going on in your life right now don't give it any energy don't give it any attention do not get involved with it be as um objective as you can step away as much as you can um from any conflict today take a step back allow the angels in so that they can help you to restore the peace they want you to know that they are aware of your challenges and the concerns that you have but until you can trust them nothing can change you really, really need to trust your angels. You really need to, to go with it, to go with the flow, to, to to go, do you know what? I can't cope with these conflicts. I can't do it. I don't want to deal with it. Just give it over to the angels. Give it up. <laughs> Surrender. Surrender those fears and doubts to them. The angels of peace are here now and they're encouraging you to let them in and bring them and bring the matter to a fair and peaceful conclusion. So obviously, for a lot of you, there may be something going on in your life. You can't resolve the conflict. Don't step into it. Don't make it worse. Don't get involved with it. Just ask. It's time to ask your angels to help you. And Archangel Raguel will come in and he will help you. But you have to ask. The angels don't, don't just come in and do it for you. You really do have to ask for their help. So if there's something going on um, today, ask them to help you to, to resolve it. Ask for the help, okay? Our next card for today is Unconditional Love. She's so pretty. Unconditional Love. Thank you, Divine Mother, for helping me to give and receive the love that I deserve. So, first of all, you've got that conflict going, just give it up. Give it over to your angels. Let them deal with it. Let them help you. Don't worry about it. Don't put any energy into it. And then we've got unconditional love. We know how important unconditional love is. We know that if we let conflicts get in the way, unconditional love doesn't come through. So hopefully if you can give, give the conflict over, then we've got unconditional love. You are blessed. To receive the guidance and support of the Divine Mother at this time. Her nurturing and loving spirit fills your energy like a cup so that you can feel whole again. She's helping you to feel whole. She's helping you to love yourself. 
she's hoping and helping you to be yourself to be amazing together with her angels she knows that at times you can feel unloved and you can find it really difficult to share your love with other people and it is a really difficult thing for people to do if you're feeling unloved yourself how can you share with other people how can you give to other people if you're feeling unloved yourself um, it's a really difficult situation um, to be in but she's here to help you she's here to help you see that it is just as blessed to give as it is to receive. You have given so much of yourself in life and in love. Now it's time to receive. It's time to receive some love. It's time to let others love you. It's time to let others let you know how wonderful you are and how beautiful you are, how amazing you are. Take the compliments. Take the love. You deserve it. Why wouldn't you deserve it? Believe in what they're telling you. Really believe it and take it to heart that you are beautiful and amazing and beautiful and wonderful and smart and intelligent and gorgeous. And you deserve every bit of love that you are given. So don't, so take it. Don't push it away. Don't push it away. Take it, say thank you, appreciate it. Because you completely deserve it. You're never too old to be mothered, says the Divine Mother. And the Divine Mother is sending you her blessings at this time so that you can feel wrapped and secure in her love. You are being encouraged to love yourself and to see that you are more deserving than love so that the Divine Mother can work with your angels to bring healing and miracles in your life. You are, being, you are a being of unconditional love. It is natural to love and be loved because it is who you are. So you are so used to giving love out, to helping people, let love come in as well. Accept some of that love. I know from doing your, your angel board card readings this, this month, um, that there's quite a few of you signs out there that are having a problem healing, that are having a problem healing your heart. And Divine Mother is saying that to have unconditional love and open your heart, accept the compliments and the love and the gifts that are being given to you and being shown to you today whatever that is it could be a simple thank you from the person down the road it could be um somebody helping you in the supermarket somebody helping you at work it could be something really really simple but be thankful for it and take it because you deserve to receive it why why do you think you wouldn't be and i just slap your wrist completely if you even think that you don't deserve it so don't and to go completely about opening your heart your last card for today is Archangel Chamuel open your heart thank you Archangel Chamuel for removing the barriers from around my heart so you are learning to heal, you are learning to get through things, you are learning to love, you are learning to receive love. The angels are encouraging you to open your heart at this time. Because of the emotional ties and the letdowns of your past, you have created barriers surrounding your heart. This, this energy is something that will stop people coming into your life and it will stand in the way of loving experiences. It's important for you to realise that the past no longer exists and the only place where you are powerful in is the present. So if you're feeling, if you've got these barriers around you, you are stopping love coming in. You've got this beautiful mother here saying, have unconditional love and accept the gifts that are coming around you. Um, peace and harmony for any conflicts that you are in today. And Archangel Chamuel telling you to get rid of these barriers, to slowly start to, to drop the barriers in order to let unconditional love in, to accept the gifts that people are trying to give you today. Okay? Try and, and just open your heart. Be more loving. Accept things that are coming through. Your heart might be feeling broken, but it is completely whole. And all you have to do is to remember that ultimately you are love love yourself be whole 
there are opportunities for you to love and to be loved at this time. The card brings positive, loving and even romantic experiences into your life so that you can feel whole again. You're a completely old romantic at heart. A lot of us are. And it's the small things that count to you on a day-to-day -day basis. By taking this opportunity to open your heart and let love in, you will allow yourself to settle. Be romanced and have a positive, balanced relationship, not just with yourself, but with others around you. But most importantly, with yourself, in order to get rid of the barriers, in order to start to drop the barriers. The angels want you to know that it is safe to love and to trust any new relations, relationships or existing romantic relationships in your life at this time. It's safe to love and trust if you can get rid of the barriers, if you can open your heart, if you can find the unconditional love there. Remember that people do the best they can around you. So be beautiful, be you, be love, and be loved as well. Allow it to happen. Obviously, it's with if it's with somebody that you don't want to, you don't want a relationship with, then yes, obviously. That's not going to happen, but you're going to do this with the people that you want in your life, the people that you really do love, the people that love you in all different ways. This does not have to be romantic. This can be your children, your parents, your aunties, your uncles, your sisters, your brothers. Allow them to love you. Allow them to bring gifts to you of love and of caring so that you can feel that you are loved. Accept those gifts. Archangel Chamuel, his name means he who sees God and he is the angel of love. His aura is pure white and ruby and his purpose is to help us see opportunities to love. So when he shows up in a reading, he can signify a soulmate bond or a relationship in some cases. He helps us to enjoy our loved ones and feel a sense of peace concerning our purpose, which is to be happy and fulfilled always. You are not put on this earth to be miserable. You are put on this earth to be happy, to shine that beautiful, amazing light of yours out at the world and out at everybody around you to make them and help them be happy too. So, namaste, blessings and light. Thank you so, so much for all your likes, your shares and your subscribes. I love you loads. Have an amazing, wonderful day. I hope that you can let in that love and accept the love gifts that you see around you today um, and I will speak to you tomorrow. Namaste.